Well, welcome and good evening, you wonderful dice of all alignments. I am Lunar D8, and this is part 7 of Let's Play Tales of Arise. OBS seems doing fine. Let's double check OBS. Ah, uh, okay. Blow my nose. Oh. <coughs> I just skipped this. You are the place my only Your friends, Hoodle? You all arrived here from Cislodia, yes? In that case, you should depart via the south gate, rather than the one you arrived through. After all that, Kisara never came back to see us. I'm surprised she slipped away without us noticing. Where would she even- I hope this place- You think the Danins and Renans have it? We didn't really do much to change- This realm had its own walls to overcome. And in the end, it was the people themselves who decided to- I hope they keep going. Yeah, well- All right. I- You've got nothing to worry about, Kisara. I'll do your brother proud. <coughs> Looks like it's take good care of Zare for me. All right, look- You've got it. Stay- Did you come to say goodbye? Actually, I was wondering if you could use another companion. Huh? Well, we certainly don't mind you coming along. We just... I thought much the same thing. However, ever since Miguel died, I've been thinking a lot. It's true that our dream of coexistence saved many Danon lives. I was so wrapped up in my idea of how things should be that I, I thought we had been given a utopia. And I chose to be ignorant. Magal's death wasn't your- Perhaps you're right. But in the end, it was me he entrusted this dream to. I learned that nothing in this life is free. Or gained without sacrifice. Now that I know that... So, decided- I have. And hopefully I can continue to protect Elderman and Sia from outside the dream world. For the sake of those still inside. And here I thought you joined for an opportunity on my life. In all honesty, I'm grateful to you. I truly am. But I must also leave your service. No longer will I be defined by protecting a Renan Lord. All I ask is that you do your part. That you fight alongside me. Not just for those who used to believe in your dream, but for those that still do. Dohalim. I understand. I'm no longer a Lord anyway. Well? This crew just gets bigger and bigger. All right, 
Way too deep. <coughs> we make for Mahogsar, the Valley of the Four Winds. I'm amazed how easily you can move such a giant sh- Really? It's really reassuring to have someone like- You know, I guess I never realized it before. But looking back, so in a way, using- You don't need to worry about protecting me. I don't plan- That's okay. It doesn't matter if you do or not. I don't protect people because they ask me to. I do it because I want- That goes for you too. Me? Yes. You see, you and I both want the same- <sighs> I'm not sure how much protecting I'll need either, but I appreciate the thought. I'm sure you'll do us proud, Kisara. Right. You can all count on me. What was Kalzalek? Isn't it obvious? Clearly he w He had to have known he couldn't hope to defeat a lord. He should- Maybe he thought he couldn't run? So he got desperate and decided- One might argue that he was another victim- Huh? There is no greater calling in life to a Renan than the Crown Continent. The shock he felt at that must have been truly immense. I know I've said this before, but Danans and Renans wouldn't cope. But that was no lofty idealism on my part, nor do I f Spare us the pity party. You literally just joined us to uphold- Shion! No, she is absolutely correct. Something. Mahog Sar. That makes four out of the five realms that I've visited now. I wonder what kind of lord we're gonna find there. It doesn't matter. If they try to get in our way. We'll take them down and that'll be that. <sighs> Toward the enemy. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Is it just me, or is anyone else peckish? <laughs> this will be a delicious Take piece it. of cake. Hey, 
Hey, look at that enemy. It's shining. This one's tough, but we have no Any choice. Healing? Let me know if you need healing. You're finished! Huh? Not today! Take this! Dance in the lane! It's Go over! I will be furious! Let's right. do it! Still. This ends now! Consider yourself... Let <coughs> you continue on yeah. in that vein. Uh, yes, my lady? Something you wanted to say? Lightning orb! Here I come! Not there! Escape my judgment! Let's do it! 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 This ends now! Consider yourself finished! This should make for some good weapon crafting material. A fish! You saw it! I didn't realize there was a po- Yeah, this is- What do you mean? As a kid, I survived life under the past lords. It's terrible to swim in, but great for catching a bite for dinner away fair in mind. Our rations back then weren't enough to live off of. You had to take matters into your own- But how did you catch them? That might take a while. Fish are- I'd put bait or a lure on a- You must not be familiar with fishing if this sounds new to you. Everything looks fine with the lure. All right, let's do this. Can't see through the wings. Looks like I lost it. Nothing's biting. Looks like I lost it. Looks like I lost it. Nothing's biting. And that's all there is to- Wow. It seems like you need to have good reflex- Kisara? I think- oh, oh, sorry. Looks like we're going to be here. That's how fishing goes. You wait- Miguel told me that- But that doesn't change the fact it's a giant time sink. Of course. Each fish has its own unique flavor, too. And you put it like that. Maybe it's worth me trying my- You're just in it for the food. <laughs> I was hoping we'd get to fish during our travels. So, if you- Good to hear. Okay!
I'm always amazed what healing arts can do. Just doing my job. No need to thank me. Just me, or have those two barely spoken a single word to one another? I know, right? But after everything that happened with Megal, kind of puts a damper on the whole journey, though, huh? How long do you think they're gonna keep? If it bothers you that much, wh why do I have to? How come you walk together like that? Uh, she really doesn't beat around the bush. You mean Kisara and myself? You hadn't noticed? You've been practically joined at the hip. Ev I guess it's force of habit, most likely. I was always ready to protect him, should the need arise. It's... Right. From being in the Elder Menencia Guard. Although, Dohali... Having guards doesn't necessarily mean the one being guarded is weak. Even so, it's not like they're entirely wrong, Kisara. I don't know. I mean, if it's what she's used to and you're both comfortable with it, then who are... But she doesn't serve him anymore. It isn't normal for her to keep following him around like she still does. You know, she's probably right. And a lot has- Perhaps I'll give it some thought, after all. Does that Of course. You might want to stop asking his permission for every little thing while you're at it. <laughs> Sorry. It's not that easy, shaking up. I've noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you, and try to do- I hate those guys! I if what you're seeking is a way to more reliably try to outclass them, I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some. They emerge as the land itself. Huh? Uh, what? I'm glad at least one of us. I shall do what I can within my mind. Why are you looking at me like that? That armor you wear is standard issue for the Menensian Guard, right? Originally, I've added some flair to it in a lot of places. I noticed, especially with that open back. We Guardsmen pride ourselves on never showing our back to our enemies. It's my way of making myself live up to that. Plus, it makes it that much lighter and easier to maintain. Hmm. Dohalim, do you have anything to say about this? Every Guardsman is allowed to wear their armor as they see fit. And you, La? Huh? Why are you asking me? This looks perfect. Guaranteed to hit the spot. Isara, let's talk for a bit. Maintaining your shield? It's becoming a familiar sight. Miguel was the one who taught me how to maintain my equipment after I first joined the guard. Your brother always seems to come up whenever- That's because we had no other relatives. So it was just the two of us growing up. He was my idol. When I became a guardsman, Lagiel wasn't too pleased to see me at first. It was Miguel- Lagiel? Oh, right. That's right. You're more an idealist than some pie in the sky. Even so, that's my brother's doing. You must have meant a lot to him. He wasn't just kind, either. He always worked so hard to set an example for me, so much so that when he thought I was asleep, he'd slip out of the- You seem to know- That's because I only pretended to be asleep. Hmm. You know what? I'm at a good stopping point with my shield. If you've got time, how about I tell you a couple more- I guess I'd better get comfortable. I'll take watch tonight. It's okay. <coughs> Before we go, do you guys have everything? Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. I just noticed none of you other Danans have spirit cores. Both of my parents were part of the resistance in Calaglia. 
In fact, mine too. We always lived in hiding, so I never had a. What about you, Alfin? You were a slave in Kalak. To be completely honest, I'm not sure why I don't have one. All the other Danon slaves are. They tended to keep their distance from me to avoid attracting any attention from the soldiers. What about you, Kisara? Do you still have. No. I was able to find a good Renin doctor who's sympathetic to our kind and had them remove it before I left. They did such a great job that. One of the benefits of Coex. I know that once the spirit vessel was shut down, there wasn't much need for me to hurry. But still, I didn't like how. It may sound a little strange to hear me say this, but. I'm just me now. Not a guardsman or a slave. I'm my own woman. This sure is one rugged road. You'd think they'd keep this at least a little better maintained. Why spend energy fixing that which is rarely used? Repairs require time and effort, which in our world means slaves. Often... Ah. For you, it may be a simple request, but that can quickly become another's difficult burden. Nobody gains anything without someone expending effort. And you know, somehow that someone always ends up being a Danit. True enough. Ideally, in a perfect world, I think it's only fair that the ones who need it should be the ones to perform. However, when doing so could be dangerous like it is here, there are many who would prefer... So, what you're saying is that people will just put up with the inconvenience until someone else... Indeed. And it is those who can no longer bear that feeling that inevitably take... Much like the Danans in our group do so now. As strange as it may be to hear such a thing... It's true that most of the Danans in Calaglia have been resigned to just accept... Still, we can't just... What are you making that face <sighs> Nah... bother fighting them because I certainly won't run away from a battle <laughs> all right Interesting moves there, Dohalim. I'm simply glad to hear that I can make myself useful to you. What's wrong? We seem to have come across some... What? You mean... No mere garbage, I assure you. Uh, uh... Are you curious? Uh, oh. 
Uh, they look like the room. And yet here I am, holding them without so much as a second thought. I am. Not really. Just that it must be nice to be a Renin who has time to indulge in stuff like that. Are you interested in this stuff too, Dohalim? Charmed may be a better turn of. I simply love objects that can give me a sense of what their maker was thinking. They. You see, we Renans have hardly any such objects that... I still don't understand what you two find so intriguing. Why not? We're talking about our own... I get that, but it's not like this stuff is any use now, does it? It's just old. Oh, but it does. Holding it in your hands like this, one can feel an... I'll take your word for it. Well, seeing as it's Dan in history, just make sure you're careful with it. But of course... sense a strange power from this. I'm even stronger than before. So I wonder if I'm getting any more people. Visibility along this path will remain limited for some time. Take care not to get ambushed. I'm surprised you know the terrain here so well. Words don't strike me as having much time for wandering in the woods. Sometimes I would take strolls along here when I wished to be alone. You always did have a bad habit of disappearing. Ring without telling any of us got... I go the wrong way. Guardsman. Looks 
like trouble with a capital T. Together, we got this. Radiant blood. Stand in it's the over. way. Ignite. Air drop. Right. Here My objective. SD airborne scoundrel. Sounds like a job for yours truly. This should make for some good weapon crafting material. It's so hilly around here. I can feel my feet getting blisters. That's mountain hiking for you. It can be pretty tough if you're not used to these sorts of trails. I take it you're comfortable with that? Oh, man. I hope I live long enough to regret this. Oh, no. Shut him down! Don't see him back!
Is there anything more magnificent than the musculature of a warrior? Perhaps it is in search of this perfect beauty that I myself am drawn into battle. We got some good equipment! I can't say its appearance is to my tastes, personally. More Danon ruins here too, I see. What were people even thinking back then? Don't get careless! Don't tell me! Wait, I'm on! Look, here! Can't Don't be see the thing! Hey, I'm all stuck! Here's up. another! Make the first strike! Now, raise it! Man, I'll be nailed! Tear you to shreds! I'm going to be nailed! Power four! Armor won't save you! The enemy wields arms too. We'll soon see about that! Do it! We got the advantage! Good! Just have to make sure we keep it! Don't worry, cause we're on the run! Watch it! I'm all stuffed up! Double demon fang! First time! Take this! I got it! Take this! So those are Dan and Astral Arts! Art Seal! Something you want to say? Not so long as you keep them... Wow! Look what I just found! Sure, I've built up a sweat with this hike. Rest assured. I have a bad feeling about this. Here I come! To the ground! Oh my! Burn it up! Power in the hurricane! Double demon fight! Rip it in half! Let's do it! Here we go! In an instant! Impact block! Now, hit time! Double demon fight! Rip it in half! Burn it out! Double demon fight! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! I need to be stronger. There. What's this place here? Some kind of old house? Hmm. No holding back! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! See you continue on in that day. Uh, yes, my lady? Something you wanted to say? It's over! Astral energy! Say no more! I think I'm getting stronger. Oh yeah? Think you could beat me at arm wrestling? When have I not beaten you? Right. I'll just go on ahead then.
Well then, I should probably think about tonight's menu. should come in hand. Through these lands most verdant green, my eyes alight for sights unseen. In Menencia, pure and pristine. What is it you see exactly? That's not for me to say.
What's that big tower over there? We should be able to cook here. a good boy. Wait, why am I petting you? This looks perfect. Guaranteed to hit the spot. Isara, let's talk for a bit. Sorry for rambling on so much about my past earlier. Don't sweat it. Come on, you... You said it, not... <clears throat> hey, Alfin. Well, it's... Yeah. During the previous crown contest, we... <clears throat> I think... That's why I... Tr I wanted to believe it. I don't blame Lord... It's strange. Whenever you and Doheli were talking about fixing 300 years... You might be right. See you tomorrow. Rise and shine. We're almost ready to leave. For some reason that just reminds me. Rise and shine, or sign. Guess I misread the landing. Here goes! You're a company! Eat your own demon fang! Run it through! Yeah. Yeah. You're 
Still thinking about how to... That obvious, huh? Don't get me wrong. I'm not going to stay his servant. However, I am going to treat him like a fellow comrade. The same way I would with you or anyone else. For as long as I can remember, I've spent my life protecting others. But isn't that what friends do, too? Support and protect one another? Which, in the end, pretty much means doing as you've always done, right? If that's what you're most comfortable with, I'm... Actually, I've been thinking about how I ought to act around you all as well. Oh? When I set out on this journey, it was to rid El... I'm grateful to you all for letting me tag along. But it got me thinking. What are you talking about? You know how to hold a weapon, don't you? Let's help it. Is it, though? Sometimes I wish there was more I could be do... Oops! Sorry about that. Gee... Now that you mention it, what do you guys normally do for food and meals when you're out and about on your travel? What do you mean, what do we do? We find stuff to eat and eat it. Eating what you like can be good for morale in the short term. But you need to think about your diet if you want to stay. Does that mean eating vegetables? Isn't that obvious? It does. Which I guess hasn't been happening up till now. Yeah, to be honest, we could be eating better than we do. Understood. In that case, I'll just have to make sure you're all staying healthy and eating right myself. Fortunately, I happen to know a- You hear that, Law? Sounds like you'll be eating your greens after all. Uh, what is it? No, sorry, it's just... I was just one. Can you cook? No, not Kisara. I meant you. 
Was there anything you wanted to add? Me? Uh, certainly you're not looking to me for culinary skill, I hope. <laughs> Typical Renan. Leaving everything to someone else. Rinwell, I don't think... That said, should you need my skills on the battlefield, please rest assured I have no intention of shirking my responsibilities. I'm sure no one doubts that. Listen, guys, if we're traveling together, we should probably at least try to make an effort to get to know one another, don't you think? I wouldn't get your expectations too high in that regard. Believe it or not, sometimes I'm not sure I even know myself all that well. Hmm... Something wrong? Not exactly. I was merely thinking about you two and yours... Uh, uh, etiquette? Indeed. To be quite frank, I find your lack... That's not being frank, that's being an... and... forget it! Do we... Yes. I find such impropriety on your parts to be deeply unsettling. It concerns me greatly. What do you want us to do? We were slaves. We never got to learn... Yeah, what he said! Perhaps, but Kisara here demonstrates that it's quite possible for... That's because I was given the opportunity to learn. Moreover, my duties as a guardsman require... Yeah, I don't think it's fair to hold us to... Exactly! Hmm, I will concede that you do indeed make a valid point. It would appear, for all my espousing the virtues of equality between our peoples, I was still looking... You don't need to beat yourself up! I wasn't that offended by... Nevertheless, I shall mind my words from here on... Having said that... I do believe you two would still benefit from learning the basics of proper society. I would be more than happy to teach you both when we camp out. Yeah, no, I'll pass. Acting all prim and proper. If you say so. How about you, Law? Oh, You're not gonna let this go, are Hey. Hey, let's stop for a minute. What's up? You already tired? My armor's pretty heavy. I think I need a little rest. I second that. All of this walking is starting to take its toll on me as well. What? You don't look it. We can't spare the time. There's places we need to be. Mahogzar's capital, Niaz, is our destination right now. But if one of us collapses, it will only serve to slow us down. And in your case, Alfin is the only one who could carry you. Best to rest while you have the opportunity. I... Enough already! I need a break, so we're taking one. <sighs> I don't need you fretting over me. Fretting? Hey, it's not like I'm... For you. For me, why? All I desire. Oh, I had to fight him. Then why are we fighting? Who even are you? <laughs> Double D! Right here! Not a corruption! Take it! Double D! Double D! Double D! Double D! Who the hell are you? <laughs> Bastard! This guy's not normal! This is unbelievable. You mean he even surpasses a lord? Double demon fang! Shouldn't have done that! Double demon fang! Double demon fang! What a relief! Sire! 
so much for sitting this by now. That wouldn't be a complaint. Nope, You're that is silly. I'll crush you! <laughs> Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! Yeah? Why do you look like Alex Mercer from Prototype? Combined with Sephiroth. Ow. 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 Will you please stop kicking our ass. Our asses do not appreciate it. <laughs> the power of the hoodoo. I actually thought we were about to see the owl die. Is that all that you've got? Very well. Then die. You just did you just aerith yourself? At least Dolave has healing arts too, so. Shion, wake up, please! Alfin? Shion! Thanks, but you're kind of crushing me. Oh, sorry. It's okay. And so am I. Oh, you can heal yourself. <coughs> Does that work that way? Uh, it's not as bad as it looks. Not bad. That's... Shion, we thought I'm you fine. were... I'm fine. Really. What the hell were you thinking? Well... You were trying to protect me too, you know. Yeah, but I have the sword. It's different. It's not different. Besides, I... Hmm? Never mind. It's nothing. Anyway, uh, thank you. But I, I didn't... <sighs> Look, I'm just glad that you're... Alfin? Sorry. I... That guy said he'd be back. I think maybe we should get moving before he returns, right? Rinwell has a good point. We need to go. Shion, are you sure you're okay?
Shion, are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I already applied some heat. But his sword went nearly straight. I'm all right. Unless I've turned into some kind of ghost and I'm haunting you all. No, I know you're... Look, I appre... There was also that strange light that appeared when she... It seemed to make the enemy retreat when he saw it. A light? I don't know. Hmm. Now that I think of it, between that light and the blazing sword, just what sort of person are you, Alfin? He wouldn't know, Dohalim. He doesn't have any memories from his past, remember? Bes I suppose you're right. We've almost reached Nias, the capital of Mahagsar. That <sighs> hey. Mm. How are you holding up after that last fight? I'm fine. If things get too tough out there... I'm not here just to... I get that. Do I look like I'm just trying to put on a brick? Uh, <laughs> I can't feel pain. But used to... Uh, look, I appreciate you're trying to look out for me. Please, stop trying to baby... <coughs> it's not that. Let me guess, wind. Doesn't seem like a very good place at the moment. Are we in the right place? <laughs> this place looks like a mess. Yes, this is Nies, the capital of Mahag Sar. I don't see any signs of people. And the buildings. Yeah, this doesn't seem like the kind of place people would actually live. No soldiers, no Danans. Not a soul to be seen. Yet look at these facades. This is clearly a Renan district. Hey, check out that drawing on the castle gate. It's from an old Danon legend about a hero who defeated an evil king with a torch and their trusty owl. That's his crest. I'm sh Really? First? It must mean the Renans have lost control of the city. Are you suggesting the Danons rose up and defeated the Lord here? Hard to believe. But not entirely unthinkable, given the evidence. Let's look around and see if we can find someone. <sighs> this is horrible. Is there truly no one here? All of these ruins look... But if that's the case... Th that's a good question. Even if the Danans rebelled and managed to overthrow the Renans here... This debris... Do you think it could be the wor Perhaps. But the appearance of these ruins is rather uniform. Hey, Rinwell. That story you told us about the- Yeah. Th then there might be some truth. Let's not jump to it. Dohalim, you forgot to take care of the fire yesterday. What do you mean, take care of? Yep. If it stays lit, we could end up in real- I see. I apologize for not realizing that. The way he's talking, it's like the thought of putting it out himself Moving on, Dohalim, I should mention that the clasp for your cape is about to come undone. Oh yes, I tried to fix that myself, but it's simp- I can't believe I'm hearing this. Are you telling me Renans can't even dress themselves? Lords like Dohalim have attendants that take care of just about everything they need. So I'm not surprised he sometimes- Even by those standards, you've got to admit this is- Shion has got a point. I mean, you don't see Renans like her needing so much- In my case, circumstances forced me to learn how to be independent. Even so, I still think Dohalim could afford to pick up a few more self- Hmm. Well, specifically speaking, what would- For starters, I think it'd be good for you to learn how to dress. And put on shoes. How to comb your hair is equally important. And learning to manage your possessions better. She sounds like his mom rattling- Oh, and another thing. About your owl, Rinwell. What is- When he starts to molt, would you be willing to give me his old feathers? I think I could find a use for them. What do you intend to do with them? Well, recently, I haven't been sleeping well. However, I hear pillows made from owl feathers are very comfortable. <laughs> this is why I hate you, Renans! Did I say something offensive? Next time, put your own needs aside for a second and think about how someone might react first.
Maybe something's going on in the forest. Those out in the valley. Windmills? They're huge. They're most likely used to harvest wind astral energy, so they have to be big. Stop right there! Don't move! They have us surrounded. Who are you? Where did you come from? My name's Alfred. You first! Show yourself! I'm the one asking the questions here. Don't try anything funny. One wrong move, and I guarantee we'll blow you away. What are you- My name is Alfin. I came here from Calaglia. Alfin? The wielder of the Blazing Sword? Getting pretty famous, isn't he? Here is my proof. Will that suffice? Or do I have to burn down one of those houses to make my point? No need. I believe you. I'm Bayfong, of the Dark Wings. Sorry for threatening to blow you away. We're still hunting down the remnants of the enemy forces, so everyone's more than a bit on edge right now. Please forgive me. Remaining? Wait... <coughs> My arm's still on fire! The Lord of this realm? <coughs> That's right. We took her weapons and turned them right back on her. Are you the Danon leader here in Niez? Nah, I'm just one of the commanders. Deadheim's the one who runs the show. I'd be happy to take you to him. Just one problem. Yeah? The Renans. Seems the rumors you were running with them were true. They are my allies. And my pillows. You do understand, right? I mean, we only just liberated the city from their They're my friends. You don't Everyone want them, you don't want me, I'll get the fuck for out. For good reason. Especially Deadeye. I think it'd be best if those two waited outside. Now they're coming in with me. Not going to happen. I don't think it's a good idea for us to split up. It's too dangerous. <sighs> then it's on your head, friend. Yeah. And if your boss is a problem with me. it, it's on her. Or his. You uh, could have left me behind, you know. Don't give a this shit. This isn't just about you, Dohalim. Ah, uh, yes. I'll respect you if you want it or not. Even after you beat the Renans, your work's only really just begun, huh? Yeah. This place seems like it's got a lot of issues to fix. I just had to get some of your street chicken. Street chicken down on the farm. So you're Elfin, are ya? Thought you'd be bigger. Huh. Guess the armor beefs you up a bit. You've got a lot of people talking, you know. But in this town, I call the shots. You play by my rules here. 
just remember that. Just don't You're be a dickhead. I expect you to run with a gang of women and kids. Those other lords must have been real pushovers, huh? Seriously? Are you this rude to everyone you meet? Don't interrupt me, you brat. Didn't your parents teach you any manners? They're dead! You... So you're the one who took down the lord of this realm, huh? How'd you pull that off? <laughs> we just swiped the Renan's explosives. And then we blasted them all to hell and back. Explosives? That's a pretty bold approach. But how'd you manage to avoid hurting your own people? Yeah, about that. That's how. The chance to take out a lord was worth the sacrifice. You killed all your own people. That doesn't count as liberation. What did this sacrifice earn you? Unfortunately, we couldn't manage to finish her off. But now we've really got the girl on the run. She ran? A lord? Yeah. The lady was just a coward. She had a whole lot more bark than bite, that's for sure. She's probably hiding off in a hole somewhere. We'll find her and drag her right back into town. Then she'll get what's coming to her. I wouldn't be so sure. She may run, but she'll never go quiet. Shut up, Bright Eyes! I would have run you through already if you weren't with the blazing sword here. The whole reason you're fighting is to free the Danans in this realm, is it not? If Shut so, your then. Mouth, witch, that's enough! If you're really fighting for us Danans. Why keep these bastards around? Why haven't you killed them already? Guys, I'm not a racist. Kill these bastards. Is that the case, huh? Then tell me the point of this show. You're a rude, very rude person. They're my friends. <sighs> friends? Renants are Renants. The scum sucking bastards who've been draining our souls for 300 years now. I'm going to stab you. Maybe it's because you and that little lady are friends and more. I'm going to punch you in the face right now. With a sword. Gauntlet works too. Son of a you'll pay for that! That's enough. Dead on. You know that was completely uncalled for. <clears throat> All of you, get the hell out of my realm, and don't ever come back. This is Tannen's realm, and it's ours, understand? I call the shots here, and I make the rules. I do, Deadeye, leader of the Dark Way! Yes! Deadeye! Liberator Deadeye! You are the true leader of this Are you really a liberator if you kill all the people you're supposed to save? It's a matter of time before I throw every last bright eye out of this realm! The Dark Wings! The Dark Wings rule! Enjoy ruling the realm of, you know, where you killed everyone you were supposed to save. Dick. Hey, wait up. We're leaving. You're, Told you're, you so, didn't I? You should have left your Renan pals outside. They're my friends. You don't agree with him, do you? I could tell by the look on your face in there. That's how <laughs> things go with him. He loses his temper. Then I step in and calm things down. Better you than me. If that's all, I think it's past time we were going. Look, I just wanted to apologize for what Deadheim said in there. <laughs> At least somebody's got some manners around here. He didn't used to be like that, but, well, that's what losing most of your loved ones will do to a man. If it was in the explosion, it's his fault. It. It's a little ironic how indistinguishable his manner is to that of a lord. <sighs> hey, Bayfon, Dead I mentioned the lord is still on the run. Any ideas where she might be? We looked all over, but found no traces of her. We heard some rumblings about activity in Esteluva Forest. But that's it. Esteluva, huh? Wait, you're not going after her, are you? Certainly won't win you any favors with Deadheim. This isn't Deadheim's war, and we're certainly not fighting it for him. Besides, it's like Shion said, her type isn't going to go quietly. Hey, it's your funeral. Don't say I didn't warn you. 
We'll be sure to keep you out of it. Before we set out, though, is there anywhere around here we can rest? Sure. Building at the end of the road, opposite side. It's all yours. We use it as temporary lodging, to house people who don't have a new place to live quite yet. We're not going to run into any trouble there, are we? Rumors of a certain fiery sword have spread fast. I doubt anyone will be eager to give you guys problems. And here's where I say my farewell. You're on your own, but good hunting. Before you go, how come you don't hate the Renans as well? Oh, believe me. I've got my bone to pick with the Renans. Just not with two of them I've never so much as laid eyes on before. <laughs> Let's head on over to that lodge. We'll figure out what our next move is there. Feeling dead, I'm signed up to be a rebel so he could have a rooster rule. Heck, he's no better than a lord. And I know. How could he use explosives on his own people? And yet, despite the toll of his actions, none of the Danans we've seen, if anything, they may well consider him a hero, which would say a great deal toward how deeply they resent it. Still, I don't think this is as simple as saying the good guys won out. Yeah, I don't either. Dead Eye might have managed to drive the Renans out of Niaz. But that doesn't make the way he did it, okay? A victory that's earned by throwing away the lives of his own people? No, that isn't a victory at all. I can understand that the Danans here are standing up against their oppression, but that doesn't mean they have to humiliate all Renans. I'm perfectly able to stand up for myself. But you shouldn't have to be, she... That's just... When, I'm... when you've been a slave for so long, it's easy to accept that's how it should be because it's all you've ever known. I don't think that's fair. For... <sighs> I just don't know me. Don't know what? Did I manage to drive out a real live Renan Lord? That's incredible. But he's got an attitude worse than any angry Zoogle. Plus, Niaz is in utter ruins. I don't have a clue what his game is. The Renans are powerful. And because of that, it... However, when you take down one dictator only to replace them with another, ultimately it's just business as usual. If it'd been Zephyr instead of Dead I'm, I don't think things would have turned out like this. Rinwell! Yeah, I think so too. Zephyr did things differently top to bottom. He's not the kind of person who would have forced his own views or decisions on other people. When you do that, you're ruling over others, not leading them. To be honest, I don't know what I would have wanted my dad to do if he was in that position. Law. The whole thing feels weird in a way. It's a weird kind of feeling, but it's Dead Eye and my dad are two very different men. For now, I'm content knowing that. The city is liberated, and yet the air still hums with fear and ang- Hums? Yeah, none of this sounds like- You don't need instruments to play music. You seem to care a lot about- Have I not mentioned it? Before I was a candidate for the Lordship, I had my heart- Yeah, we had all cuts in, you playing a violin. You? A musician? Indeed. <coughs> music enriches the world around us. I train- Words could not describe my bliss as my notes- <clears throat> Forgive me. My loquaciousness can get the best of me. Don't apologize. It's interesting hearing what Renan co- <laughs> Even though the Renans destroyed all of our arts and culture. Personally, I was interested in the- The fact that generations of lords deemed music to be of no use to their slaves, and outright forbade the owner- Not that my words can undo the damage. What's hard? What? Mm -hmm. Heck. Yeah! Good. All right! Dead I'm creep certainly has a few screw. Forget that guy. 
Right? What's there to discuss? Dead Eye Men's crew have already brought. I want to go after her. I second that. I we don't know if the Dark Wings have what it takes to beat her. I'm worried. <sighs> you make a good point, Renwell. <laughs> and maybe just being. I have to agree. This realm isn't going to be truly safe as long. Fine by me. Our job is to break down the walls that oppress Dana. What he chooses to build in their place. For now, we'll head to this Estaluva. Whatever we decide. going Alfin you should get some rest what's got you up at this hour just let me be for a minute okay I will when you do <sighs> have it your way Shion the Lord's days are numbered you can trust me you know maybe even lean on me a little and if I say I will will you finally <laughs> what was all that about So we're just going to check things out, right? In whatever that forest is called. Estaluva. Forest. Next time, pay attention. Someone's calling out for us. They could have something they need. Mm-hmm. Well, I see. <laughs> mm. oh. Excuse me! <laughs> Good. That's some cryptic text, all right. It could mean anything. Can't we just look around the area for clues or something? Hey, maybe these are supposed to be different locations? Oh. Now you're into this too, huh? in my eyes the winds are strong here mind yourselves Ugh, even the inside of my mouth is all sandy hoodle don't get blown away okay the winds outside the capital are blowing you can definitely see why people call this place indeed maha earth water fire wind light and darkness Rena is aligned. Is that because some elements are easier to gather and ser That is certainly possible. But I suspect the biggest reason is to prevent- Funny. You would think infighting would come naturally to an elite class of- True, but the Renans rule as a minority. Fighting ourselves would just be destructive. Though, as you saw in Menencia, any abstention from fighting is merely a facade. In the end, you all get usurped whether you like it or not. Hmm. That may be- We have to catch up to the- 
What is that ring of rock? Oh, yeah. Funny. I guess I've gotten used to weird rock for me. Most likely. They were brought over by us, Renans, when we first... Wait, those? So does that mean there's some kind of... To manipulate the properties of... Really? Think about it. It astral energy by nature. So the Renans reformed it for the crown cut. Sounds like the crazy thing a Renan. Renans these days are more advanced than Danans in some ways. But even they don't seem capable of doing some... Or is that something that's possible on Lenegus? Or... I can't claim to know everything about my own kind. But I myself have never seen anything that would be capable of such... But at some point they did just that. You're so amazing, Kisara. Maybe you should take a page out of her book and learn to make yourself... Hmm. I'd be happy to teach you if you want, Rinwell. I... Really? Even how to sew and... Yes, indeed. He knew... Sounds like he was a pretty handy guy. He was. I'd... Now that I think about it... Lagil is that woman who was with him in the... Funny you mention that. I think it still looks gorgeous. From what I can tell, it would appear as though the only thing he didn't manage to teach you was how to apply... No, but that didn't stop him from trying. He really wanted to teach me everything. And here I was trying to make a joke. I can't tell if she's being serious. The only one here who knows him well enough was her. Yeah. I guess only Miguel could have told us if it's actually true. Okay. Hope everyone had a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day.